brain itself moves forward or back and uh, hits off the skull, causing bruising or swelling. And typically the only bones involved with this injury are the maxilla and mandible, which are your jaw bones, and the skull itself. Uh, signs and symptoms uh, vary throughout the grades of concussion, which grade 1 to grade 3 are very different. Uh, grade 1 is the most mild form of a concussion, and grade 3 is the most severe. Um, typically care for these uh, injuries are similar throughout, as you must be approved or returned to play through a doctor or physician. And uh, only observations and uh, recognition of these injuries uh, can be done within my scope of practice. Um, so to begin, if you believe an individual is uh, concussed or could possibly be concussed, uh, the signs you should watch out for are uh, confusion, um, forgetfulness, uh, irritable mood changes, um, dizziness, nausea, um, loss of balance, um, and many more. Um, so to begin, I will show my models I've made out of uh, Jello. This base model here would be a um, grade one concussion. And this one here would be a grade two concussion. And this one here would be a grade three concussion. Now, I made my model out of Jello because it resembles a brain the most in the way that it jiggles and it moves around as that's how our brain becomes uh, susceptible to concussions. Well within high impact sports um, you have certain protective gear like uh, mouth guards, collar guards, um, a helmet uh, and more that try and prevent these injuries but um, these injuries still occur and are still uh, very common in high impact sports. Um, as an example, um, the common law that we all follow for concussion protocol is known as Rowan's Law, which is based on a, an individual in Ottawa who was uh, playing high school rugby. Um, so this individual uh, was concussed with uh, three times within three weeks. Um, unfortunately, uh, after a concussion, if uh, an individual is concussed within the same spot, it's very likely that a fatality can occur. So to avoid these um, complications or a possible fatality, um, concussions must be taken very seriously regardless of their grade. Um, in conclusion, thank you for listening to my video and I uh, hope this uh, brought some awareness towards concussion, concussion protocols and uh, concussion observations and assessment within my scope of practice. Thank you.